Hello, following the series of videos concerning the dam that we are doing today, this is the last one for today, and now we are talking about Hosetsu no Den. This Ho comes from the verb Tsutsumu in Japanese, which means to wrap, and uh, Setsu comes from Kiru, which means to cut. So it is something as to wrap uh, what is cutting. The idea uh, behind this, this Den is quite interesting and different. Well. Um, for the sake of illustration, let's see. Suppose we are here in a swati position, and then we uh, no, just entered in a situation, in a fight, and uh, he'll try to um, deceive me. What he's going to do is he's going to put himself in Harajime no Tamai with the second intention to uh, invite me or to, to take me in. Uh, in order to draw his tanto and pierce me. So this is his idea to, to get close and, and pierce me. So what I'm going to use, what I'm going to do is when he tries to pierce me, I will just isolate his major weapon, in this case his tanto, and I'm going to use the cloth of the hakama itself so I can, in just one, one turn, always having a, a the, the cloth to wrap and a, um, a support, in this case his own leg, here, so once he is wrapped, I can just move on, passing his guard, kneeling over his lower ribs or even kidneys if powerfully enough, so I can take the power out of, of, of the needle of, of his body and then move on to gain better positions until I have and a, a pressure and a lock on the cervical area. So the idea is that even if he tries, I'll ask Sensei Luis to try to take his hand out so you can see that he is trying to do it so, but it's quite difficult. Now, let's see. If we are here in Suari position, now let's say we are here and all of a sudden he tries to I, I won't move out, he'll just show. Like this. So, one more time, what I'm going to do is just defend, block as a, a first, first movement, a first reflex, and then using, in this case, his thigh, his knee, and the floor as a mechanism to keep it locked so I can do this safely. And once I have wrapped his, his wrist, his hand, it gets quite difficult for him to take his hand off. As soon as I did this, I will enter spinning and hitting or touching his happiness and his shoulders, so I'm preventing him to roll over and try to regain his position. And from here, once I'm bracing him, I will just use the cloth, uh, his own hakama, So there's no way he can take his hand out of here. Now well, let's see other passage, other example. Suppose he will try to, to pierce me in the neck. I won't move out, he'll just show. He violently draws his, his tanto and pierces. Whether here or here, it doesn't matter. So, one first block and isolate. All I'm going to do is to, to reach his, his cough here and keeping it, uh, keeping it over pressure, on pressure, so he cannot stab as I'm moving quickly from here. One more time, I have now heels and the, the, the ground itself as a, mechan is, as a stopping mechanism, okay? So from here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to press forward violently so he cannot, please, since he tried to take his, his hand out, he just can't, kneeling and breaking his ankle or breaking his shin, which inflicts a lot of pain. If violently, we could have some serious injuries and a very painful uh, movement here. Let's see some other one. Now he tries to stab me on the neck or in, the, in this area. Just the same thing, blocking as a first movement and then isolating. 
using the floor as a stalking mechanism, as we have seen, getting close to him, like this. But now what I'm going to do is, I'm going to put him here. Once I'm here, I'm grabbing his foot, I am anchoring my weight here so he cannot roll forward. I have this, and this. So this that we have seen was Osetsu, Osetsu no Den, uh, which consists of the idea of wrapping and evolving, just wrapping what, uh, well, what would be his major weapon, in this case, a Thank you very much.